stretching. Oh, okay, I'm ready. Anyway, Shanghai 2024 major update, ladies and gentlemen. Yippee. We've watched all of the RMR matches on Twitch. We are going to watch all the major matches on Twitch. And we're obviously going to go get the diamond coin. Easy peasy. There has been an update. We are now having the major hub available, the viewer pass. It's really cool that everybody can do the pick'em now. All players with prime status can place pick'ems for free. However, to complete challenges and earn rewards from an event stage, you will have to activate a viewer pass before that stage begins. So you can partake, but you're not going to get anything out of it if you don't pay for it. So that is actually thumbs up. Music hits, don't care. Gameplay, uh, some stuff that I actually don't really understand, but cool. Uh, annotation, don't care. Misc. Don't care, except they added the ability to rent weapons from all previous CSGO weapon cases. That is going to be a fat W. All of the people that are holding cases right now, like, you know, stonks. As soon as you rent stuff from a weapon case, the case disappears after. So that is an absolute W, and that is a major change, actually, within the game. Then you have a couple of fixes on the maps, but yeah, whatever. Let's get into the big thing of the update, the Shanghai 2024 Major. Stickers, Major Hub, Pickems, Diamond Coin. Let's go. This video is sponsored by Skins Monkey. It's really easy. I have this, Ooh. it is worth that. Ooh. And then I can choose that much. Trade done. It's a fast and most importantly safe way to trade your skins, but also so much more. They offer you to buy skins for cheap with a 30% bonus, an extra 5% on top of that, plus you get up to $5 on your first trade free if you use code TWEEDAY. You also get free stuff on their freebies tab via giveaways or tasks to complete, so don't miss out. Go check them out, it'll 100% be worth your time. The link is in the description. Thank you. I bought the pass! I've bought... One of the sticker and autograph capsule out of all the three categories. So we have six capsules to open and we're going to do the entire pick -ems. So the video is consisting of me doing all the pick with you. And then we're obviously going to open like a sticker capsule. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. The pass actually does look cool. Activate. Nice. Hopefully this is going to turn into a diamond. Okay. Since we've co-streamed every single RMR game... And I have also planned on co-streaming every single major game, twitch.tv slash Twitter. I feel pretty damn confident in making this thing happen properly, okay? So I, 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 I do believe uh, that I have what it takes. And if not, then it's not my fault. It's your fault for following my pickings, okay? So just we're going to get that all, all, all out of the way, yeah? Uh -huh. Okay, round number one. We're having Fury versus Gamer Legion. I'm going to go with Fury here. They should potentially do it. They have played a better game overall, but Game of Legion can still surprise. Oh, God. That is going to be one of those where I play the odds in the end. But yeah, we're going to go with Fury. Virtus Pro versus MIBR. Oh, God. I don't like Virtus Pro. I don't know. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not liking their aura. That's not really my type of thing. MIBR is not that good either right now, but they did play convincing in the end, so... Let's just roll with MIBR here, yeah? That is... Is that a shout of Virtus... Oh, man! It's so hard to bet against Virtus Pro, but at the end of the day, you know? Ah, oh. Locking in, ladies and gentlemen, on Virtus Pro, though. Even though I don't really enjoy watching them play, Virtus Pro is going to beat MIBR. Team Liquid versus Cloud9. I have to go with Team Liquid here. They seem to be better overall. Cloud9 did have a convincing little group stage, but you know what it is. Complexity versus FlyQuest. Complexity will win that one. If Complexity loses against FlyQuest, that's going to be one hell of an upset. Big versus Passion. Not even a question. <coughs> Big will obviously beat them again. Um, Major Copium or not? Yeah, Big versus Passion. It, I mean, that can go either way as well. But I'm going to go with Big over there. Fnatic versus wild card. I will actually lean more towards saying that wild card will win this. Wild card had a fantastic armor. They looked really good as well. Fan like again, pretty close game, but wild card should be running away with that one. Mongols versus rare atom. <sighs> should be an upset potential, but again, Mongols. Pain versus Imperial. Pain is definitely the better team there. That leaves us with round number two. Where Furia will play against the wild card. That's going to be a hell of an interesting game. 
I want to say Fury, but Wildcard as well plays really fucking good lately. Fury versus Wildcard. Are you thinking Fury and Wildcard? I do, bro, I, I swear, if Wildcard played a better game. Don't underestimate the Amaranth buff that Wildcard is having. That is a good shout. But I still can't get bet against Daddy Fallen there. So we're going to go with Fury. Huh? Then we have Virtus Pro versus Pain. MIBR is not going to manage to beat Virtus Pro, even though honestly that's going to be a hell of a close matchup. But I do believe that Pain will be making it against Virtus Pro. Now we're looking at Liquid versus Mongols. Super duper close game as well, even though I kind of lean towards Mongols here. My heart wants me to go with Liquid. Complexity versus Big. Big is beating Complexity. Big could beat Complexity. Big could go 3-0 here again if they play good. Big, oh my god! Big is gonna go 3-0! Let's go! German Counter-Strike's back! Sorry. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's the energy drink, I'm telling you. Remember that the ESM Black Week is live. Minus 70% with code Twitter. Mwah. Link at the first top comment, yeah? Don't forget about that, guys. The best product on the market. <clears throat> Jesus. Sorry, I'm getting carried away, guys. Fanatic versus Imperial. Fanatic is going to win that one for sure, for sure. Gamer Legion, Rare Atom. Gamer Legion is going to beat Rare Atom as, as well. MIBR versus Passion. Passion will win that one. Cloud9 is going to beat FlyQuest. Those are actually... I would say those are rather easy matchups then to predict in that sense, I think. No? Maybe MIBR potential upset against Passion, but I don't think so. Now we're looking at the round number three. Yeah. Fury versus Pain. That is going to be a hell of a brawl. But I think Fury is going to come out on top. All those domestic matchups usually go really, really fun. So that is going to be a hell of a matchup to watch. Liquid versus Big. Wow. Do we believe? I believe Big is gonna actually free zero the shit out of this. Like, act. this is not this is not like a full copium pick. I do believe that Big can win against Liquid as well. So we're gonna go with Big here. That ends up in the free zero. Big and Furia Esports. Yippee. Wildcard versus Passion. As much as I want to say Wildcard, these Passion players are crazy fraggers. So, in a way or another one, Passion is going to win against the Wildcard here in that best of one. Virtus Pro is going to get absolute dominated by Daddy F and Fnatic. Complexity versus Cloud9 will be ending in a Complexity win as well. Mongols is going to beat Gamer Legion. Which then leaves us in a 0-2 bracket between Imperial Esports and Rare Atom. As well as MIBR and FlyQuest. Which is gonna, and this is how it goes. Rare Atom will beat Imperial Esports. Whereas MIBR is gonna beat FlyQuest. So we're having the Zero Freeze set in stone. Imperial and FlyQuest. Those are the Zero Freeze for me, yeah? Which leaves us in round number... <sighs> four. The two ones are up. Liquid versus... Fanatic. That is a relatively unpredictable because oh, actually Liquid is kind of unpredictable, no? But still Liquid should be making the free one here. Lock that in. Passion versus Pain brings us to Passion, I think. Even though Pain is incredible as well. They've been having a really, really good individual games too. But I don't know, when it comes to the fragging potential, which Pain does have, Passion is just like that much better. They're in... They, they're... Oh. Complexity versus Mongols. Wow. Who's going to be that one? I'm going to go with Mongols here on the 3-1 bracket. Mongols has just been playing relatively convincing overall. And they have to have something more up their sleeves as well. Wildcat is going to beat Rare Atom. Gamer Legion versus MIBR. I do believe... Oh, I do favor Gamer Legion here. Virtus Pro is going to lose against Cloud9. Which is then going to have us in the 3-1 bracket. On the free one, this team, these teams are going to advance with free one. Liquid, Passion, and the Mongols. And one free out is going to be Rare Atom, Virtus Pro, MIBR. Which leaves us with two best of threes left for the teams that are going to advance to free two.
in this bracket. It is either going to be Wildcard versus Cloud9. I do favor Wildcard here, actually. Complexity versus Fnatic. <sighs> as much as I don't want to see Blame F go out, but... and uh, mm, uh, let's Yeah, Complexity seems like the better shout here. And Pain should be winning against Gamer Legion. Alright, let's sum this bitch up for you. Sorry, excuse me for the language. <clears throat> let's sum this bitch up for you. We're gonna have a free zero of Big and Furia Esports. We're gonna have the zero free eliminations of Imperial and FlyQuest. Yeah. Now we're looking at the free ones, which is Liquid, Passion, and Mongols. Liquid, Passion, and Mongols. Rolling over to the free twos, which is gonna be Wildcard. Complexity and pain. Save all picks. Don't forget about that. Happened to me in one major already. I forgot to save the picks and then suddenly it was like, yeah, GG over. Bang. <sighs> Select your favorite team and use the graffiti for the duration during the tournament. Well... Okay, we got that. Um, last thing for the video. We are obviously going to go and open up a couple of sticker capsules just for the fun of it. It's not going to be like I will try to invest into these or whatever the hell. Uh, stickers are, I mean, not bad. Uh, nothing extraordinary, right? So it's just another one of these borderless ones, whatever. Uh, I've never been too keen on stickers, let's be honest. So It is what it is, guys. Anyway. Let's open up really quickly. Uh, ba -da -ba -ba. What is it? Well, anything gold is going to be nice now. Gold, gold, gold. Uh, nice. Instabated. Okay, I'm okay with the G2 thing. What do we have now? Shanghai, Legends, Autograph. Uh, yo, <laughs> JL is going hard. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> Bro, it looks like a small, smiling dick. What is he thinking? <laughs> Can I please unbox JL Golden Dick? That'd be crazy. All right, let's let's ha let's have it, guys. Let's have it. Let's see. Ah, hi, exertion. Okay, then we have a Shanghai Challenger sticker capsule. Oh, that shows that the logos, the logos, the logos. All right, let's have a look. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Alright, so we're obviously not going to get any luck here. I suppose, autograph capsule, anything cool in that? Uh, did they actually... Bro, they're actually farming Chinese fans, that's crazy. Honestly, I think it's a really, really, really good thing that the players had to draw the signatures themselves. That is really good. I prefer that a lot over them having like these, you know, pre-made artistic stickers, whatever the hell. That is a lot. That, yeah. Uh, yep. 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 Definitely. That is a lot cooler. All right. Let's go. Uno mas. Uno mas. Uh, yep. 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 Oh. Are we even going to get something else than blues? I mean, usually I'm never getting anything else but than blues, but I'd appreciate that. Okay. Wait, what? what, what wait, did this... Why the hell is Dexter's signature sex? Huh? How did that make it into the game? I don't get it. Huh. Oh, <laughs> that's crazy. What? Oh. Yippee. Okay, one more. Contenders capsule. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, blue again. Okay, we got uh, as lucky as we're always getting with this, with the uh, case opening slash stick opening slash whatever. The pickems are locked in. And I'll see you guys all on the Twitch channel when we're watching the major together, yeah? Every single game, I'll be live. So don't forget about that. Follow me on my Twitch channel. It's in the description too. And uh, 
Cool.